Okay, so I'm going to show you how to create a pull request template. Uh, it's relatively simple. Let's check out and just say, uh, oops, new branch, and we'll just put chore, um, but, 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 uh, PR template, right? So we've checked out. Right now, when we raise a pull request, there's not a pull request template, and you will want one of those if you're working within a project. You know, tell people what you're changing, if you bump the semantic version, all the good stuff. Now, to do this, it's relatively simple. Create a markdown file, pull request, template. Now, the only annoying thing with this is GitHub doesn't allow you to have various different options, like from an organizational level, so you will have to do this at each individual project. Now, all you gotta do in here is pretty much specify like your markdown, so description, and you can test this in a markdown editor online. This is generally what I do when I build this. This will be a pull request template. And you can use fancy things like, did this get uh, a semantic version bump. Um, let's have a look here. Is this a great pull request? Um, let's have a look at this one. Did you uh, five head this pull request? Um, what else? Did you add tests to this pull request um, that are good and not crap? Okay, you've got a pull request now. What do we do? Okay, ooh, okay, we've changed that. Let's commit here. We'll just say feature, not actually, no, it's chore. Uh, pull request template, we'll add that. We'll do a git push. Oh, we need to set the upstream branch. Cool, let's set it. Right, so now we have a pull request. Boom. Oh, it's alerted me. Compare and pull, compare and pull. Damn it, it's not there. What's going on? Okay, well, um, maybe we didn't five-head this. Okay, we'll create the pull request. Uh, da, 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 da. We'll just put char PR template. Get rid of that. We don't need this. Confirm merge. Boom. Jobs are good done. Delete that branch. Now, okay, check out master. Master? We don't sell that anymore. Uh, git pull. Uh, git checkout. New branch. We do testing PR template. Okay, we're going to. What is it? The app? Is it the app we need to change? Yeah, it is. Okay, cool. Um, this will be amazing. Um, okay, now we can create another pull request. Uh, fix, uh, no, feature, amazing feature. Amaz amazing feature. Pull, get put, oh, no, we don't wanna do that. Get push, we'll take this nice. Uh, I need a shortcut to grab that, um, so I don't have to just do that all the time. There is actually one way you can do that. I can't quite remember, but I'll show you on another um, uh, another video as to how you can actually just not have to do this each time at a um, project level. Uh, okay, pull request. We've merged one. Boom, we've got another. Whoa, it's there. Amazing. Okay, did this... No, we didn't bump that. Is this a great pull request? It definitely is. Uh, I would say yes, I did five at this one. Did you add tests? Uh, we'll, we'll lie and say we did, but damn it, it didn't uh, do the tick boxes. How do we do the tick boxes? I've forgotten how to do the tick boxes. Or it gives you a nice tick. Uh, let's see. Let me look at one of my old repos. I'm gonna cheat here. Um, I've forgotten how to do that way. You get the nice. Um, how do you do that now? I want it so when you tick the box, it looks good. Uh, oh, I made a mistake. Did I make a mistake? Um, should it be this? Is it the X? Normally is the X. There it is. Okay, cool. You can change that locally, but uh, essentially you just want to do this. And it should. So what was the issue there? Okay, the issue was you need one of these hyphens, it looks like. So if I take off that, yeah, you need a hyphen. Okay, so... It looks good, we'll get rid of that, get rid of that, get rid of that, cool. Okay, so now if you put the hyphens back in, um, not back, we're not putting them back in, we never had them. Um, we'll just remove these ones, da, 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 da. oh, can't do that. Um, okay, let me push this again. Git commit, uh, fix, I was wrong. Push, cool, should be there now. Uh, we'll test this template by just putting it in here. Preview, boom. Uh, yes, I did that. 
Did I do this too? Yep, yep, yep. Just put your X in, boom. It shows you've done it for the user, whoever's reviewing it. This looks amazing. This is now a pull request template, amazing feature with something amazing. Okay, go down, confirm merge. That's your pull request template. It looks really good. You can do all sorts of stuff in there. Merges, you can use headers, descriptions. It's complete markdown. So it's uh, yeah, relatively uh, simple. Now when someone raises a pull request, they, oh, what am I doing? There's nothing compared. PR template, oh, no, it didn't work. Okay, fair enough. Um, whenever you raise a pull request anyways, you'll get that. Um, and you should have that in every project, so do try put that in there.